There is a time and a place for being extra. One of them is uh, this website. One thing we want you to consider is utilizing some of the kitchen tools you have that you may not use often. A quick and easy way to do large format ice is just a typical bunt pan. You're gonna see in other modules how we're shaking cocktails. Aeration is another big pillar of why we shake cocktails, especially with citrus. Once you get a little bit of air, a little bit of water, and a little bit of life into it, that's my preference. Building highballs and spritzes. Carbonation is key. It really just adds a really vibrant and fun component to the drink. So we're gonna get into all of that while looking at all the specific ingredients we're using, the garnishes, and the glassware we'll be serving into it. We're trying to take fresh ingredients, dry ingredients, and infuse them into a liquid form. Infusions. <laughs> so essentially what we're gonna do is turn this into what looks like, I guess a French braid if you wanna consider it that. Throwing introduces less aeration than shaking. If you want, you can get a little sassy with it. When you're chipping this up, you just kind of want to break all of the corners first and make a mess on your kitchen counter. And then you're just going to take your strainer, push it forward so you're really engaging the coil, and then you're just going to slowly, sensuously pour it over your big ice cube. We're going to make an original drink called the Fromage Noir. The Grower's Tea Punch. White Negroni. And I'm going to make the Tropic Like It's Hot. It's got all of your favorite summer island flavors, but with the addition of Japanese whiskey. You can use classic cocktails to build your original cocktails off of. A fun way to experiment a little bit is to blend different base ingredients. So oftentimes you really need to taste as you go. I really needed that, I'm gonna be honest with you. And see what really works well together. So we're gonna talk about how you do that and make delicious drinks if you wanna flex for the homies at home. And remember, when you are making cocktails at home, you are the HPIC. And as long as you're having fun, as long as you like what you end up with, then you're doing it right. Cheers. Can I drink it now? <laughs>